welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video, um, I wanted to talk about um, my pregnancy so far. Um, I am tomorrow will be four months and well, four and a half months um, tomorrow, 18 weeks. If you do weeks or months, four and a half. So um, I thought that <clears throat> it'd be fun to kind of start talking about it and you know, letting people get a, like an inside scoop on what happens while you're pregnant. Because you definitely have a lot of questions and not everybody's willing to talk about the nitty gritty stuff. They'll talk about like, you know, the joys of it and all that. But in terms of like the real stuff is what I call it, <laughs> the shit, <laughs> um, you don't always get to hear that. You have to like, you know dig and talk to like your really really close friends and even they won't necessarily disclose like everything or they've forgotten so it's nice to like kind of have like an informational video um of someone's experience which everybody's is going to be different but there's going to be some things that are going to coincide from person to person so I thought I'd share um I know it's here um I know it's a little late in the game to start doing this I didn't find out that I was pregnant so I'll go back um, until I was about two months along. I had went on my um, vacation to the Bahamas with my husband. And um, my menstrual cycle hadn't come, but I didn't really pay it any mind because I know it flip-flops and stuff. So I just waited to come back at, you know, come back home. And I was like, oh, let me take a test. And lo and behold, it's, you're pregnant. So um, that definitely was different for me because... I've always said that I um, didn't necessarily want to have kids. Um, and I think it's because a lot of stuff that I see in the world and I work with kids. So you kind of, you know, have that, mm, I don't really want to do this kind of thing. And I'm, and I'm one of those people who don't really like a lot of responsibility. And that's definitely going to be something that's going to change for me. But um, it's definitely going to be fun. Um, it's going to be new and it's going to be a blessing, so... But yeah, so two months long, which is why, you know, this video is coming now at four months because like in the, once I found out, I was basically two months and then, you know, getting ready to go work on the third month. So, um, I noticed that back when I found out, before I knew I was fine and then as soon as like I knew all of a sudden I'm like really nauseous, um... I wasn't like vomiting or anything like that. It was more of a queasy, stomachy feeling where you feel very like sick all day. And you don't have a lot of energy to do stuff. You just feel drained, um, a lack of energy. I noticed that I wasn't really um, interested in any of the activities that I normally like, um, like shopping and things. I just kind of wanted to um, do as little as possible, like go home um, after work. I didn't want to go out to eat. I still don't really like to go out to eat a lot. Um, but, yeah, kind of the same thing. Um, uh, I did notice, like, as I got into maybe, like, the third month, um, I got a little bit more winded. Um, that could be from me not, like, exercising normally, so now I'm putting on a little bit more weight. I'm, like, breathing heavier. You can hear, like, me in between talking to you, you know. So, um, I wasn't really showing at all, um... I'm now just starting to show, like, I have a little bit of a bump here, um, and I'll show you guys that. Um, you, you kind of can see it. It more so comes, like, um, you can see it a little bit. You kind of have to search for it. You wouldn't know still, um, that I'm pregnant unless I really tell you. Um, or, like, if, if I've eaten, I notice that my stomach gets really, really, like big, like it'll start really small in the morning, really small. I don't really have a baby bump. And then like if I eat a good sized meal, then I've definitely gotten like the big bump going on. So um, I don't think it's like a true bump yet. So that's kind of cool because I'm trying to, you know, um, stay rather small because I don't want to like really blow up so fast. And then, like, I'm waddling around, so I'm just hoping, like, I can maintain, like, you know, a smaller, um, state as far as, like, you know, eating healthy and, like, making sure that I'm doing what I need to do, but I'm just, like, you know, fingers crossed, don't want to get too big, you know, um, put on the right amount of my weight that they said that, um, that they were looking for me to put on, 
which they said that um, no more than 20 pounds for me based on like what I was weighing and where I really should be at so I'm not to go outside of that um, so hopefully I can maintain that um, what else <clears throat> I, I feel like you know with pregnancy my health has definitely seen a decline um, <laughs> I say my health is going to shit. That's what I usually say, like, every day. Um, which I should stop saying that. I don't know. But, like, right now, I have a sore throat. Um, and I'm trying to, like, drink tea today. Like, I heated it up, so I'm going to go get it in a minute from off my nightstand. And, um, what else have I noticed? I just feel like, you know... Some days, like, I'm tired, but not as much as I was in the third month. In the third month, I was, like, needing naps a lot. But, like, now that I'm in, like, the fourth month in between, I feel like, um, heading into the fifth month, I'm not, like, as tired. I take naps here and there. So, I just feel like it's not, um, the fatigue is definitely worn off some, um, cravings. I don't really get any real, real cravings. I've, like, wanted... Um, some french fries like yesterday, um, I've wanted like Cheetos, you know, he, um, a few times, but nothing like really exciting or major. I've wanted Mexican food like once, so, I don't know, I don't feel like it's been like, oh my god, stupid cravings, but, um, I've, you know, picked up a few things here and there that I've wanted to have and like, flipped out like I need that you know um in general oh I've also noticed something really um major that I have noticed is like this cramping that's been ha happening um it's like like a sharp pain will come all of a sudden I don't know what's going on I guess it's something to do with my uterus um and all that stuff taking place in my belly but it's like a sharp little pain that'll take place and I don't like that. It was happening for like a week. It's kind of like subsided. I did get one last night, but it's not unbearable. They're really quick and fast. Um, kind of like a cramp almost, but yeah. Um, hmm. Those are really the only major things that have been happening like in the fourth month. The cramping, um, very light, if any, cravings, and, um starting to show a little bit um when I eat more but like as far as like when I wake up in a normal basis Michael is over there dancing um then I don't really notice <laughs> I don't really notice it being too large so um yeah but I have um definitely feel like the health is not as like my immune system is definitely not as strong as it was before so that's something that you do have to combat. And definitely infections too, you know. Um, you can be prone to like yeast infections and UTIs and things like that. So um, those are things that like you have to look out for. Um, and that I've experienced with this whole pregnancy. So that's a personal TMI. But I think like, you know, it's important for people to know that. Like you do have different like infections that you can get and stuff that are like normal things that happen to a woman's body um that people don't really want to talk about all the time so yeah um that's kind of like where things are now i'm gonna do like these monthly um updates so when i hit the fifth month i'll let you guys know um a little more i may even do like a update prior to that because i'm going to find out what the sex is so that's gonna be really exciting um, so I'm going to come on here and tell you guys that, and that'll be before I'm actually 20 weeks, so, um, no, it'll be actually, it'll be exactly at after. So, yeah, I'll tell you guys on the 20th week what I'm having. So, yeah, um, thanks for watching. I hope it wasn't a draggy video, but, yeah, talk to you next time. Bye.